Rockies. Did you say like a business, Rocky Mountain? Did you say a business luncheon? Business that, luncheon. <laughs> what? It's just funny. It it's, was a luncheon. It wasn't just me. It was a group of people. Right, but it but but is multiple people a luncheon and one person's a lunch? Well, a lu- no, a lunch to me would be you go with a couple of friends or right. maybe with a couple of coworkers. That's a lunch. A luncheon is like an if this was an official like hey this group of large group of people I'm taking to lock keepers. How has it become official? And who designated Gary Mincer took us. Okay. So he designated it as an official luncheon. I think he even said like uh, Welcome to lunch- the luncheon? I think he no, I think the email was, you know, group luncheon. Wait, was, was it, it all ladies? No. Because chicks would say a luncheon. <laughs> ladies luncheon. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you have the ladies who lunch lunch. We have ladies lunch. I think it, when it's more than a small group of people, like a few people, then it becomes a lunch in. I feel like, like there's. I think you're making that up. Oh, okay. <laughs> now, where you I'm, could be? I'm not but certain. I... <laughs> because I, it could also be that your luncheon, which is just spelled I N with an apostrophe at the end. <laughs> We're luncheon. <laughs> hey, yeah. a couple of us are hey, we luncheon today. Yeah. Let's hey, lunch. let's go luncheon. Okay. What's okay, the definition so of luncheon? I'm just saying a this is a formal lunch. That's... But who designates it as you weren't dressed up? Yeah, it was lock keepers. That doesn't mean you have to get dressed up. It's down the street. Yeah, it I didn't was, dress up. It I was, was there yesterday. formal in nature because it was work related. So it was like. But I, when we first started talking about lock keepers, I said, "Oh, I remember. I've been there. I had a work lunch there one time. I had a business lunch. Yeah. You went to a luncheon. I was just curious as to now. I know what a luncheonette is. But you wouldn't have a luncheon with just two people. Well, there were four of us there. What's the minimum number to demarcate lunch <laughs> from luncheon? I'd say like seven. Because dinner's just dinner. Breakfast's breakfast. Brunch is brunch. There's no brunching. You go, well, we had six people, so it was a brunching. It was 18% tip <laughs> mandatory. You but know? now I'm going to make brunching a thing. Brunching should be a thing. Yeah. I think if you can't fit in a booth, it's a luncheon. Is that what it is? Yeah. Because we were in a booth. We were at a big round table. Yeah. An eight top? How many people? More. It was like. A 10 top? There's no such thing as a 10 top. 11 of us or 12 of us. A 12 top? Like a big round table in the center of lock keepers. Like Algonquin? Type, I don't know what that is. Knights of the Round Table. Anything yeah, like Knights that? of the Round Table. So sure. it was a it was a formal luncheon. It felt luncheony because of the big round table, and Gary's like at the head of the table, and it was like a was form, we got the formal. Of a round he table. the head of a round table. We got, well, well, you know what I mean. He no, I like, don't know what you mean. I don't know what you mean by luncheon. I don't know what head of a round table is. You're <laughs> twisting my mind into a pretzel. Uh, I'm trying to get things defined he had the here. Fancy chair. Okay, know? so he had a throne. <laughs> So it was like the Algonquin Knights of the Round Table. Wow. Did he call himself Lancelot no, during but the whole it felt thing? Like Did you guys luncheon. all stand up and use your butter knives and like hold them into the middle and touch them tip touch no, the tips together? We did the passing of the bread and the passing of the butter dish. It felt very luncheony to me. Did anybody pull a knife out of a roll and then that person immediately got accolades from the rest of the butter knives? I don't think so. So a luncheon. I'm genuinely trying to determine what the, this interests okay, me. Okay, here are the here are the bullet points. Okay? Bullet points. Okay. More than just a couple of people. But that's vague. Okay, seven or more. I like bills. If you can't fit in a booth, it's a luncheon. Seven you can't or have a more. In a booth. Seven or more people. Group of people. Work related. So anything seven and under is still a lunch. Yeah. Okay. Work related. And Work you received related. a formal invite to so the, attend. So no casual luncheons. No. No, because it's formal. Yes, that's that what a luncheon is. A yeah. formal lunch. But what makes it formal? Okay, like I just said, it's work-related. I received a formal invitation for it hmm. via email. What was the gender ratio? Were there more chicks than guys? I think I was the only girl. Only girl? There might have been one more, but that's not how rare you, because this building is mostly dudes. How did you make the cut for the formal luncheon? Uh, I think mo- I think he was taking out different groups of people. Were you? What group were you in? Was this an employee of the month type situation? No, this was a gr- just a select group of people that he wanted to just... Take out and how were, you and didn't ask how you were selected. Brains. No, you didn't think in fact, you didn't go. How did I get in this? Also, Who else was at the luncheon? I can't remember. This was like a year ago, I think. There were a dozen people, and you don't remember who else was there. Uh, okay, I think Bill, have you ever been invited to a luncheon? No, nor have I. Now I'm curious. I think it was maybe we need to stop wearing panties. Yeah. <laughs> It would. I think. I think I had drinks with Gary Mincer nine years ago when he wanted to hire me to come here, and I don't think I've gone out with the guy since. It was. Kind I saw of him like, at Steely Dan. I shouldn't say. Uh, I think that was he there the day when Billy Black left. We had that no. dinner or that that lunch. Nope. 
Yeah, okay. I'm a jerk. So, nope. I can't remember a single person that was there. Wow, good job, Erica. Maybe it was two years ago. So not so formal. Mm-hmm. No, but um, well, not so memorable. It was like it was kind of like to get a state of the union to see like how people like were feeling with the company and like mm-hmm. at their jobs and whatever. It was just kind of like a like a random select group of people to Did just. Did anyone say that they feel more comfortable the if the company wasn't twenty billion dollars in debt? <laughs> Because that's what it, that's my yeah. concern. Did he pull? Did he pull uh, in his office? Did he pull balls from a drum by any chance? When I you were no given idea. a number. Okay. In fact, I'll be honest with you. Until the actual day of said luncheon, I thought it was just a lunch. I thought I was going to lunch with Gary Mincer just by myself, and I'm just like, I don't know what this is about, but okay, I'll go. I'll go to lunch. Hmm. But then I realized there were other invitees on the list, and it was a whole group of us. So in the interest of word economy, you wouldn't say a business lunch. You'd say, I went to a luncheon. But then you'll have a jag off like me busting your chops to figure out. <laughs> a work luncheon. Well, that sounds redundant based on your definition of luncheon. True. Then it was a luncheon. Did okay. you have to drive to the place? Did I you, drove you to there? the luncheon. Okay. What yes. does that have to do with anything? Oh, well, because I didn't know if there was like, no, you know. No, he didn't pick me up in a limo <laughs> and take me to this. Honestly, event. if there was 12 uh, people, that can fit inside of a long why would stretch there be limousine. a limo to work? He thinks of everything in terms of VIP. No, it wasn't about VIP. He wants to be a, a very important pound cake. It was about mm-hmm. being all together, you know, riding there together, eating together, and riding back together. It wasn't even about that. I just figured if you want everyone all at once. You guys would okay. People are texting me. They want to know. Let me ask you this: Were there any awards given? <laughs> Were there any uh, notable uh, uh, achievements recognized? No, no. That, like I said, I think it was just a random group of people, and I feel like I always get thrown in. If there's ever like a random group of people like needed for something, I always get thrown in there because I'm the young chick here. I mean, so they're not. like, oh, hey, what's what are the kids doing? Hey, let's get Erica to come to this one. Alan, this sounds more like Erica was part of a focus group. <laughs> Were it you felt, part of a focus group? No, because we didn't it. It didn't feel quite like a focus group, but in a way, because it was such a random group of people, that's that's how it seemed to be selected. So you were selected to tell them what the kids were into, even though do they know you're 30? I'm well, this is a few years ago, so oh. she wouldn't qualify anymore. <laughs> oh, it was a few years ago. Yeah. Okay, right. They got to go Notice next Notice I haven't been also, invited to another luncheon. Yeah. <laughs> can't be a focus group if you can't focus on the other people that were there. <laughs> hey, guys. Thanks for watching. Plenty more where that came from. Click here to subscribe. Click here to watch another video. We'll see you next time.